morning. It is day three. I'm just getting up. I'm still sleepy. What? I don't. Ah, right, you know what? You know what? I'm feeling pretty good. I'm not. I'm really tired. You guys tired? We're gonna whisper first because I like you, alright? Whisper, whisper, whisper. On three. One, two, three. SGC! That was not a whisper, okay? That was like a little big whisper. I'm whispering. A little quiet, a little quiet. On three, on three, on three. Whisper. One, two, three. SGC! That sounds so creepy. That sounds so creepy. Never had a repeat winner. It's quite amazing. So with that said, I want to introduce you to our eight finalists. Are you ready, guys? Here we go. Go Ultimate Warrior on this. All right. We're currently in eighth place with 186 Iron Man points. Matthew Arenas. In seventh place with 196 DSP. Doing well. It's Eric Morin. <laughs> In fifth place with 208 Iron Man points, Vincent Zipporah. <laughs> 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 <Vincent Zipporah. laughs> In fourth place with 260 Iron Man points, Kevin Ivan. <laughs> champion with 328 Ironman points, Ryan Flores. <laughs> Currently in second place, our returning champion with 330 total points, Mike Lukanov. <laughs> in first place with 370 Ironman points, Josh we get Because easy allows for most hits and least deaths. So we want to make sure you can score as much points as possible. Anyone play the original DuckTales? Yeah! Yes. Who here loves DuckTales? Yeah! Who here wishes they were Scrooge McDuck? Yeah! One of the ducks. That's cool. A wealthy duck. Wealthy Mallory. Where's Bruno Bloss at? Where's Bruno Bloss? It's got to be around here somewhere. All right, here we go. Here we go. Getting into it. And away we go.
He's got $22,000 right now in six seconds. That's nice. Is it the coin? Let's get this with the cutscene. There you go. $32,000. I really just think that you guys can see in the corner there. That's all. Oh! Eaten by the plant. Fifty-six thousand. Thirty seconds left. You're gonna help me count down at 10, all right? 58,000. Get it again. 15 seconds. Pick it up, Dodge. What do you got? 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, That does not count. Time expired before he got that. Time expired before he got it. 58,000 was his score. Does not count. Good and try. Good effort. All right. for an SGC woo, because they, uh, they, need, uh, they need the adrenaline. So uh, everybody, uh, how about you stand up for me? How about that? Everybody, everybody out to see this one. Everybody, everybody up. Everybody ready? Everybody ready? Let's 
You guys have no idea how good you guys make me feel. I really appreciate it. SGC 2013 has come to a close. Day three, it's all said and done. And I gotta say that that um, con depression you feel after after a fun weekend has kind of set in. I had a lot of fun this weekend. Today was more so a light day. I was still completely knackered from last night. We stayed out way too late, and I just had so much fun dancing along to uh, DJ Cutman's cuts. The Mario Party After Dark event uh, kept everyone out well past 3 a.m. I woke up late this morning and made it just in time for the um, Iron Man of Gaming panel, which um, led directly into the uh, closing ceremonies. I took one more bounce to go check out the uh, the indie game room. I uh, finally got a chance to play the Angry Video Game Nerd game, which uh, the video shows there. But the majority of the day was checking out the Iron Man of Gaming, which was a lot of fun. They showcased two really awesome surprises. One was the fact that the finals had um, had uh, two games in it that were not even uh, released yet by the time this uh, video was being shot. One was uh, the remastered DuckTales, and the other one was a surprise to everybody at the con. It erupted in just screams and... and and just joyous banter about Killer Instinct, the Xbox One game that was featured at um, at E3, was the final game for the Iron Man of Gaming. It was actually pretty sweet, pretty awesome. Um, I'm still not fully sold on the Xbox One, and um, but damn, there's just something about that game that looks really, really awesome. It looks like it's confirmed to be a six-button fighter. Uh, it's retaining the combo-heavy uh, uh, theme of the original Killer Instinct, which was what made it very distinct at the time. You can string together these long combos and um, you know just find a what's called a combo breaker and get out of a combo. Uh, it was really awesome, and I got the videos up too as well. Overall, SGC was fun. I can't wait for one next year, and hopefully. They'll do it again next year. I uh, got a chance to speak to Craig and uh, Sean Hines talking about um, the possibility of a next year, and they mentioned that on the website they will launch and, uh, and announce whether or not they'll be able to do it next year and have some dates for everybody. So hopefully, you know, keep your fingers crossed, and let's hope that Listed Geek can make another appearance at SGT 2014. Um, once again, this was fun. This is my first trip to Dallas, and even though I didn't really get outside, it was... Way hot, way hot. I had a really awesome time this weekend. I wish my team could have been here with me and I wasn't on my own. But I have to um, give a shout out to uh, Marissa. Um, goes by the name Lovely to Die For with the awesome group of ladies to die for. Thanks for being my buddy for this entire con. I know you're alone as well, uh, but I appreciate having a friend. 
Uh, made some other friends here, uh, just random fans and G1s that are just as fervent about ScrewAttack.com as they are about gaming. Um, popped into the vendor hall again, just to see what was going on. Uh, didn't really buy anything, couldn't really um, you know, swing it since I have a bag that's completely full already. Anyways, can't really bring anything back. But um, keep it locked on LiftedGeek.com. I'm going to be giving out some beta codes. I'm going to be giving out some, uh, some Steam codes for games that I checked out the Indie Heaven. And once again, thanks for watching. Uh, get lifted and look to the website soon because a write-up for SGC is going to be up there. So keep it on luck.